Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. Salam Khan here. And today with a new topic. Using the Karno maps technique, we today we uh, we design a seven segment display. Seven segment display. Seven segment display decoder, alright? So this is what we designed today. Now what is this seven segment display? So as it is clear by the name, it is a display consisting of seven segments, alright? Okay, with this uh, display we can display numbers, uh, decimal digits, we can display digits from 0 to 9 all right and how do we convert them into this digit 0 to 9 this uh, display works on binary so we have to convert it from BCD BCD to this uh, uh, decimal all right we have to convert it from BCD to uh, to these into these seven segments all right bcd to seven segments now what are these seven segments so let me show you so we have what one two three four five six and seven now these are the seven segments of this seven segment display all right which are named as uh, a b c d e f and g all right so they are named as a b c d e f and g so what do you do now if you have to display a zero you have to display zero so which segments need to be on all of them except the G needs to be on so it means this is a zero with the help of what with the help of a seven segment display if you need to display a one so this B and C are on so this is on all right now if you have to display a two so this A is on B is on uh, G is on E and D all right for three again A is on B is on C is on D is on and G is on okay if you have to display four now so F G B and C for five we have A we have F we have G C and D all right now for six we have uh, uh, F E and D G and C all right, so this is six. Now seven is what? It's A, B, and C. Now for eight, we have all of them on. A, B, C, D, E, F, and G. And for nine, we have A, B, C, G, and F on. So these are the numbers we can display from zero to nine, all right? But you know that B, C, D is a four-bit number, is a is a 4-bit number BCD is what it is a 4-bit representation so we can represent 2 to the power 3 is a maximum 16 and from 0 to 15 numbers with BCD we can represent from 0 to 15 but here in this 7 segment display the maximum number that we can display is 9 all right 9 is the maximum uh, with 7 segment display all right so which means the bcd from 10 to 15 in this case are what they are a don't cares all right we don't care about them now how are they made so we see them now all right all right so now we write the the four bit bcd all right uh, and and we are representing this the segments by abc to i represent this these bits by B's all right so let's say the most significant bit is B3 then we have B2 B3 
B1 and B0, all right? And then the seven segments. So A, B, C, D, E, F, and G. Okay. So let me make these partitions also. All right. Now you know how to fill uh, these uh, bits, all right? So first, you have, you have how many? You have uh, from 0 to 9, which means you have 10, okay? So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. All right, then what? 2, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, and 0. And then group 4, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, and 0, 0, finally. And then group of 8, so 0, 0, 0, 0, and 5, 6, 7, 8, and the final two are 1s. Now you know these, how to do. <laughs> I, 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 I came a little, uh, I didn't follow a straight line, okay? Now this is what? This is the term M0. This represents a 0, which means, okay? This is the term M1, which represents a 1, M2 represents a 2, M3 represents a 3, M4 represents a 4, and similarly M5, M6, M7, M8, and M9. All right. So this one is M9, this one is M8, this one is M7, this is M6, this is M5. All right. 5, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. So these are the numbers that we can represent with this 7 segment display. All right. Now, now, now we have a look. Okay. For 0, which one is on? So we fill them over here, all right? For 1, the ones that are on, we take them a 1. The ones that are off, we take them a 0, okay? So, over here we have a 1. For, for 0, all of them are on except the G is off, okay? So the G is off. And the rest are on. So you have a 1, all of them. All right, now, for, for, for one, for one, uh, these two, B and C are on, B and C are on, and the rest are off. Yes? Okay. So the rest we have zeros. All right, now for two, A, B, G, E, and D. So we have a lot of them on, so off or what? Uh, I'll, I'll let you. So A is on. Yes, A is on. Uh, B is on. Yes. C is not on. Uh, D is not. Uh, D is on. Uh, A, B. Then we have G on. And then we have E on. And then we have D on. So F and C are off in this case. All right, for two. Now for three. For three, uh, only F and E are off. F and E are off, okay? E and F are off for three, and the rest are on. All right? Uh, yes. F and E are off. Now for four, we have A off. For four, we have A off, uh, and we have E and D off. E and D off, all right? And the rest are on. For five, we have uh, B and E is off. B and E are off. And the rest are on. Yes? Now to display six, we have A and B off. And the rest are on. A and B is off. And the rest are on. Alright, I hope you are getting it, okay? Now for 7, for 7 we have uh, F, G, E and D. F, G, E and D are off, alright? And the first are on. For 8 we have what? For 8 we have all of them on. For 8 all of them are on. And for 9, for 9 uh, only E is off. For 9 E is off. 
All right, so I believe you are you are you are able to see this, okay? For nine only e is off. All right. All right, so I believe you have understood this, the basic introduction to, to what? To the seven segment display decoder, which bits are on, which bits are off for each of the decimal digit. I end this lecture over here and we see the next part, how to obtain expression for A, B, C, D, E, F, and G. So we ex obtain the expression for this in the next part of this lecture. All right, so I divide this lecture into two parts. So see you in the next part very soon, inshallah. Till then, take care. Goodbye.